found another steel GameStop. Uh, price tag is $14.99. It's like a $100 game. Sweet. Morning, guys. Uh, 6.04 on Sunday, August 1st. Uh, I'm heading to the Seekonk Flea Market. And it's the first time it's been open in like three weeks due to weather. So, I'm hoping to find something cool today. Uh, video games would be awesome, but I know there's a guy that gets in there early with some friends, so it's kind of hard. You know who you are. <laughs> uh, anyway, so, I don't know, hopefully find some cool stuff still, and yeah, then I have no idea where we're going after that, so stay tuned. Later. Yeah. This is a lot of people showing up for the first time in a couple weeks because of like I said because of weather so if you haven't already subscribe to the channel smash that like button comment as you see me find stuff what you like what you think I missed if you think I picked it up all right stay tuned to the end for all the cool pickups later look at this there you go. Yeah. What are you getting on the uh, Saturn? 30 bucks. 30 bucks? It's by itself. No wires or anything? That's all I get. Do you know if it works? No idea. No idea? That's what I got. What about the game gear? 20 bucks. Same thing you don't know. I have no idea. Just get a clean out. How much on the controllers or the controllers come with it? 10 bucks a piece. 10 bucks a piece. Pick up a bunch of stuff I do. 200 each, there's 15 charms in each for the box. What'd you say? How much each? 200. 200? Each? Yeah. Okay. Thank you. What, do you. what about the fight stick? 20 bucks. 20 bucks. Hmm. Might take that. He's in the controllers. Buy the whole thing. I put them in a big box. Buy the whole thing and go home. That's what you <laughs> need to do. It's for Xbox. Forty bucks. Forty bucks. This is a nice box uh, one. Fifty bucks. First aisle. How you doing? We need some food. Those are, Those are all empty. Those cases are yeah. Okay. Well, sometimes you can still use empty cases. Yeah, and uh, Chibi Robo. Are you talking to me? Yeah, yeah. Oh, this sorry. one right here. Uh, DS one. How much do you buy? Free game. Are you get any games? Uh, five of these for. I'm about the PS4, Xbox One, but I don't know. Last of Us. My favorite game. Is that a good one? GameCube, no control, uh, no book, just, wow, battery pack for the Game Boy. How much are the controllers? Uh, ten. ten. each? Yeah. <sighs> the
Yeah, I think I'll be going through it and make that dirty, but <laughs> PS1 is actually one of my favorite errors. Thank you. Every time someone says, I have PS1 games, they always have Gran Turismo. I think that was like, yeah, one of the, it's like a staple. Razor scooters. Spongebob. It's hard to believe Spongebob's that old. Oh, yeah. Nice shirt. Back in the day, you had to buy games based on the art. Yeah, right. You didn't know anything about it. And then you get a game, and you'd be like, five dollar piece on the games. Yeah. Sir. Nah, 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 nah. What do you got on those ones? This one. This one. What do I want? Twenty, and then ten on those. Ten on each of those. Yeah. Okay. They may be sold. Just letting you know that. I suppose it said he's getting his money. Yeah, well, yeah. It is what it is. It's news you lose, right? Yeah. Yeah, I'm with you. That's all. I'm... How much are the DVDs and stuff? Games or anything or not? No, it's got the control of everything. Okay. God Eater 3. God Eater 3. Oh, that's good. Here you go. I'm going to try. I'm try. That Max is a good one. Yeah. This is X tricky. You know, a friend of mine was like, oh, find me that. And I found it, and now I see it everywhere. It's funny. You know, every time I turn around, there you are. Um, well, we're Let's see, there. Right. So. <laughs> Did the long box? Did I? Well, I'm not smart, so there you go. Uh, okay, oh. Supermans. No. The majority of those are, are priced in the notebook, though. Did you use the same notebook? No, I did not. I used the big one. It's probably under there somewhere. Yeah. Both of these piles are his? Both of those piles are his, yes. Are the uh, games kept elsewhere? Uh, nope. I haven't had a chance to go through all the games. Okay. There's a, there's a couple. Where is it? Luigi's Mansion. Yep, this They're one's empty. These are empty. The case in the book alone is 20. And oh, this okay. one, just the case, is 10. Okay.
put two dividers in. Two this. Box. Maybe, yeah. Just little pieces of paper. Trust. We'll put these separate because we have these. Oh, boxes. that's cool. Separate from that's those. Okay. And then another piece of paper separating oh, the one. Alright, uh, GameStop again. I uh, found this one this time, Attack on Titan 2. It's like an $80 game. They do have a $55, but I have my $5 coupon and then like $15 thing off, so I'll probably grab it and then flip it. Quick and easy. Now you got a Looney Tune with me, so. Alright. What's going on guys? Uh, here's a recap from everything I've picked up since last week. Uh, I actually found some pretty good video game stuff this week as you can see. So I'm going to dive right in, tell you where I got it, what I paid for it, and go from there. Uh, so first off, I'll start over here. I grabbed this stack off of a guy who is there pretty often. I don't know where he keeps getting games from, but he's been finding stuff. Uh, I paid five bucks a piece for these. Uh, pretty good lot. You know, Super Mario Galaxy. Um, Street Volume 2 is complete. This is like a $30, $35 game, so, and it's in nice condition. The uh, Shut Your Mouth, not bad. And Tunnel B1, I grabbed this one because it's not something I was familiar with, but it's an Acclaim, and it looks like a like a race fighter kind of game. So, uh, And I looked it up, it's like 20 bucks, so not bad. Good lot there. Grabbed this guy during the week at savers for a dollar 99 as you can see uh it's like eight to ten bucks but it was in real nice shape and that particular savers i go to i never really find anything this is the um i may have shown this last week so if i did i apologize um but either way two bucks not bad so i'll go this way so this stack here nothing super crazy but i paid five bucks uh for what is that? Seven games? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah. So not bad there for five bucks. I'll take that all day. They were in the bottom of a bag of DVDs. Guy said buck a piece. Um, I thought I only had six for some reason when I counted them. And I said, hey, you do the six for five. And he's like, yeah. So uh, ended up being seven. So apparently I can't count. <laughs> uh, off a buddy of mine, Mark, I bought off of, and he's bought off of me when I've had play, uh, this shop. Got all these for 30 bucks, which isn't bad. Both Mario DS's, uh, let's see, the Curious Village is like 20, 25 bucks. Uh, New Super Mario Bros, easy 15 to 20. Same thing with these. Um, some Sometimes they go higher, and they're complete. They're in nice shape. Uh, it was nice to find some Mario games, and he told me, hey, 15 bucks. Uh, he told me 10 bucks a piece on these, and then he ended up giving me the three for 25, and then I added him in at the end. Uh, he had some other stuff too that you guys saw, but nothing super crazy. He wanted 20 bucks alone for the Mario, uh, was it the Mario Luigi story one? Uh, I couldn't think of if that was a good deal or not, so I left it. Uh, grabbed this guy for a dollar. It's all complete. It's all there. It's not super expensive. I think it's like 10 to 12 bucks, something like that. But, uh, GameCube games for a buck. I'm not going to knock it. Got them from a guy who we bought from before. He basically has tons and tons of games. Most of them are either empty cases, wrong games, or whatever. So, still happy to get that cheap. Um, yeah, it's pretty much it. So, uh, this lot was actually the first lot I picked up on Sunday. The obviously Sega Saturn two controllers, the uh, the two games, and the four um, demos. That one's not a demo. That's the one that would have came with the, the system. So three games and three demos. Not bad. I paid, what did I pay for this? 60 or 70 bucks for the lot. He said this was untested. It looks pretty clean. Um, I've gotten a few of these in the past and they work pretty well. So I'm going to test it. Uh, I will throw in a clip if I remember. <laughs> you guys will see that now. All right, everybody. Moment of truth. Everything's plugged in. TV's on. Here's this. Make sure I have the right input. Green's good. Okay, so far so good. All right, just leave that. So, it's looking like it's good to see if it reads the game. 
It sounds like it is. So, so clicking and doing this thing there. And I put in uh, high octane. Just something to run it. So it looks good. Sega high octane. All right. Awesome. So definitely, definitely a good pickup there. Uh, hopefully it works. I'm going to test it. Uh, actually right after I do this and that'll actually make the third Saturn I have in my possession. I'll have two for sale um, And I needed controllers because the other Saturn I have doesn't have a controller So that it's nice to have two put one with this one with the other one and then I can sell them off because I have a Saturn I don't need anymore uh, The Mario Kart double dash in this really cool bag here. This is a pencil case from 1989 88 Picked up from a couple guys at a place at one from one guy that we go to very rarely um, This is only the case, but I Have a loose disc that I'm gonna end up putting with that. I gotta check if I have a manual I don't think I do but I'm not gonna complain about that at all uh, So that'll make mine More complete. Maybe I'll see if I can get a manual somewhere. Uh, this is going to grant He already claimed it and I said yeah, no problem I actually when I grabbed it and picked it up I actually was thinking of him when looking at it because he likes that kind of stuff uh and last but certainly not least are these two games uh i don't believe i showed this one in the last video if i did again i apologize uh, i picked this up at gamestop for 15 bucks this is going to grant um it's like an 80 dollars game so definitely check that out now that i think of it i think this was in the last video so again sorry if i didn't remember i should have checked but it is what it is this one i know it wasn't because i picked it up literally yesterday today's wednesday um i usually do these on thursday but i got so much crap going on i try to get ahead of myself uh grabbed attack on titan 2 um if you guys know that most of the attack games on the playstation 4 are rather expensive this was marked in store for 54.99 uh, i had my five dollar coupon off and then i had tons of points so i just used some points and ended up getting it for like 20 or 25 bucks uh actually i have the receipt in here wrong receipt um let's see hang on yeah so i paid 29.99 so not bad still if you look up this game on ebay i will put up a screenshot um it goes for 80 goes for like 80 to 100 bucks so definitely not bad even at 54.99 it would have been a pretty good deal um i'm not sure if i'm gonna hang on to this because i'm doing retro world expo in november but i don't know if i want to hang on to a game of that uh value for so long we will see did you guys I have my stupid receipt hanging out there. Uh, but that's it, guys. So I really appreciate you checking everything out. I hope you like what you saw. I hope you appreciate the footage. Hope that works. <laughs> so thanks for checking it as always. Uh, smash that like button. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Make sure you comment down below what your favorite find was or maybe something I missed. People do it all the time. So that's it, guys. Thanks for watching. Peace out.